Hi everyone, welcome to the Nick Center. I'm Russ and today I'll show you an exquisite, a wonderful piece. Also, I put some pictures with it on Facebook quite a while ago, but I never had the chance to show it properly. This is a German First World War era pickle halbe, but it's not a regular helmet, a lobster helmet, uh, used by <coughs> the armed forces, because those ones, if you remember, they have spikes. This was from the Emperor's private guard. So only the officers from the, the Emperor's guard used to wear one of these. Usually the German helmets of the of the era <coughs> uh, will have the German eagle here with or without the uh, state badge because Germany was split in different states was a federal country. But the helmets from the Kaiser's guard had the eagle on the top. It's a very rare piece on the antiques uh, uh, the collector's market. It is highly valuable. This one is about 7,000 pounds. And uh, you won't be able to, to find it in uh, many private collections either. Probably you'll see some of them in museums. I'll show you how it looks. <coughs> really like to do that. Believe me, it's a heavy thing. <laughs> but probably they are really proud to wear it. It is entirely made of uh, tin. It's made of brass, actually, and uh, is uh, uh, with tin margins. And um, inside, it has a leather lining, <coughs> which used to be cached here with a rope um, in order to adjust it. Uh, it. It is more comfortable than you think. On the sides, you have on on this side, you have the Prussian cockade, which means the Prussian national flag which is uh, black white and black and on the other side you have the imperial german state flag which is black white and red uh, not all the helmets had this kind of um, uh, cockades the german state cockade will be present on pretty much all the helmets but on the other side if you are from a different state let's say baden state or bavaria or so you'll have a different cockade and in front, you'll have, for the regular tubes, you have the German eagle uh, uh, shaped plate. And for the officers, you usually have the state uh, um, sign here. So it's, um, this one is actually, this is the Kaiser's private coat of arms. To indicate that this, the, the chap that wore this was an officer, you have the the straps here, the chin straps, which um, are gilded, they're uh, um, made of gilded brass. The regular troops will only use leather. And this is called, by the way, uh, also it's called a lobster helmet because of the funny tail. It was used at the time in all the armies, or the big armies of Europe. Uh, the French use it uh, on the uh, cuirassiers and dragoons and the British use it on their dragoons as well. So basically the cavalry had a helmet like that, uh, made of brass or tin or just pressed steel. So yeah, this is a unique, unique piece. Thank you for watching. If you like the show, please subscribe, please follow me. <coughs> and uh, I'll see you next time with more wonderful things. Bye.